Hello everybody, welcome back. Today I have a haul video for you. Now these are things that I've bought over the last month and a half and these are going to be from eBay, Craft Stash and a Facebook selling page. So if you enjoy haul videos please do make sure you're subscribed to my channel. I do have a big spending problem. Haul videos are a fairly regular feature of my channel so please do hit that big red subscribe button and let's just jump straight into the video. So the first thing I bought off of eBay were these little magnets for my stamping platform. I had managed to temporarily misplace one magnet and obviously as soon as I ordered these ones I found the missing magnet but I thought you know these are actually quite handy to have and what I liked about these ones were they do have the plastic holders um, and I know that's probably a bit gimmicky however I use washi tape on my current magnets and it breaks and it comes off and then you've got to try and pick the magnet up and it's just a palaver. So I just thought I quite like that they've got the plastic casing. They're obviously going to slide in and out. So easy to transfer them over or what have you. And um, yeah, I now have four magnets on my stamping platform. But that's quite useful, especially when you've got a really sticky stamp. So that's the first thing I bought. These were under a fiver. I will leave as much as I can linked in the description box, but I can't guarantee the prices will be what I paid. And none of the links I'm leaving are affiliate links either. These are all just to be helpful links. Then I got these pens off of eBay. So I had an idea for a Christmas card and I needed a gold glitter pen and then I thought if it worked I'd probably want to redo it in silver as well so I got a pack of gold and a pack of silver the gold I'm a bit disappointed with they are more yellow when they come out than gold they're glittery they're nice but um yeah my idea didn't end up working anyway so it's fine these are really nice these silver ones I do like them but I now have a lot of gold and silver pens <laughs> um so yeah, I will probably play around and see if I can come up with any ideas for Christmas cards with these, but they're always handy for Happy Mail and stuff, so those I have. And then I needed a white gel pen, and when I went to get one, mine had run out. So I went back on eBay, and I bought these ones. These actually come in three different sizes, so the ink comes out in like different widths, which is quite good. Um, and I've been quite pleasantly surprised by these. Again, these weren't expensive. Um, I will, as I said, leave as much as I can linked. These are Sakura, I think that's how you pronounce it. But yeah, quite happy with those. Always handy as a staple in your stash. Then on Facebook. So this was on a Facebook selling site. I'm on a lot of the craft selling pages and I keep telling myself one day I will get around to doing a stash on there and then I just don't let's be honest I do browse fairly regularly I've never bought till now but when I saw this stamp I had to have it and if you've been with me a while you will know exactly why when I show it to you so it was this cardio stamp now if you're new to my channel I am an equestrian I absolutely adore horses um, and it was the horses in this set that sold it to me. I have made a card using this already. It's over on my Instagram. If you want to go and check it out, I will leave my Instagram linked below as well. But I absolutely loved this. I think this was £11. And that might have included postage. I can't remember. Anyway, it was fine. And I'm really happy to have that. So absolutely love that and then I have my craft stash order now last week craft stash put distress and distress oxide inks on three for 15 pounds um, and I only just this year and very recently decided that I prefer the oxides over the normal distress inks I just find I get a better blend I've just find them easier to use so I'm trying to build my stash so as soon as I saw three for 15 I thought yep gonna get some of those um these do sell fast when craft stash do that offer though so you literally have to jump on it or it's just all gone but I did manage to get some so I got 
seedless preserves and I got wilted violet because I don't think I had any purples and I wanted some purples then I got spiced marmalade marmalade don't know what I thought I was gonna say then and carved pumpkin um I didn't have any oranges and I just think that's a nice those are two good colors to have in your stash then I got Salty Ocean. I have got a lot of blues, but I really like all the blues and I use them a lot. So I grabbed that one. I didn't have any greens, so I got Pine Needles. Um, I got Festive Berries. Again, I didn't have any reds yet and I really like Festive Berries. And this time of year, let's face it, that's kind of what we're doing is festive cards. So I had to have that. And then I just grabbed Kitsch Flamingo. I can't think if I had a pink or not. I might not have had any pinks. So I got Kitsch Flamingo and then I got Lumberjack Plaid. Oh, I don't think I've got this even in the normal distresses. Because I got the festive berries and then I needed an extra one ink to get to the 3 for 15 on the last like little bit I was doing. And I thought actually let's try one that I don't think I've ever tried. So those are what I've got. I'm really excited to add them into my stash and start using them. I am going to collect all of the inks in the oxides, but I will only do it when they're on offer or if I see them like on a good price on one of the selling sites. Again, on the selling sites, as soon as they go up, they kind of go straight away. Um, but I think Craft Stash do do these on offer fairly regularly. So... I'm just keeping my eyes on their emails and that's my little haul for today so i hope you have enjoyed seeing what i've bought um i'll just leave a random website cross dash link in the description box because that's where i got these from but they're not on offer at the moment and most of them are probably still sold out um, and then i will link the ebay stuff if i can and the cardio one um i actually saw the lady put this up again so i will try and leave a link to the facebook listing if i can i don't know if that'll work um so i think she might have a few but um yeah really really pleased with my little goodies the craft stash order i placed it i think it was last monday or tuesday it was processed on friday it sat there all weekend it got dispatched yesterday which was monday and it's tuesday and it's just been delivered by every who had said it was coming between half 10 and half 12 and then pushed it back an hour but it's here and that's fine so you know everything else came really really quick the cardio stamp was super quick she literally posted it the next day and ebay's always quick so all in all fairly happy thank you so so much for watching my video today i really appreciate everyone that takes the time out of their day to watch my videos let me know what you think of my purchases in the comments down below and did you take advantage of the craft stash offer last week if you have enjoyed today's video please do give it a big thumbs up and if you're not already subscribed please do hit the big red subscribe button I will be back soon with more videos. So until next time, thank you once again for watching. Take really good care and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.